Welcome to section 13 on data sorting, filtering, and pagination. Right now, whenever the client requests a list of data from the server, like a list of tasks for a user, the client has very little control over what data comes back. If the client does request the list of tasks for a specific user, they get back every single task for that user in the order in which it was originally created, and that's not ideal. As users add more tasks to the database, all of those tasks are constantly going to get transferred back and forth, which is going to slow down our app significantly. It would be much better to give the client a little bit of control, choosing what exactly it wants back. This is going to allow us to add some awesome features to the application where a client can provide a search term and it just gets back tasks that have that search text in the task description. It's also going to allow the client to get back just completed tasks or just incomplete ones. The client will be able to filter the data alphabetically or by when it was created, and we'll be able to set up pagination so we're not fetching every single record constantly. All of this is going to create a way more efficient application. I'm excited to get to it, so let's jump right in.